Hi, I'm Michael Spitzer, CEO of Green Power Inc. We're here at the Waste Expo 2007 and we are very happy with the reception we receive. Green Power was founded in 2000 with the idea to take care of the waste problem here and abroad. Not only to create energy through burning this valuable resource, but to converting it into a fuel product that can be used to run our cars, trucks, planes, and bring goods to the market at a better price and with more security for all of us. We have joint venture partners now around the world in India, Australia, Ireland, UK, and numerous other countries, which shows that the world is ready for a change. Also, the waste industry was very receptive and want to work with us so that we eliminate landfills and the problems we have with landfills. The process will be explained by Jim Astolo, our technical advisor and senior VP with Parcel Engineering. Cadillac depolymerization process uses a recirculated hot tar carrying catalyst and lime to depolymerize, crack uh, hydrocarbon waste materials and produce a diesel product. Byproducts of this are water, carbon monoxide, carbon dioxide, methane, which are consumed by a diesel generator, and a, and a tar residual that can be used as asphalt. A brief description of how the process works. The unit works on a modified pyrolysis. They can call it catalytic depolymerization. It's a recirculated loop of hot tar. The tar is carrying catalyst and lime. It operates at about 700 Fahrenheit. The loop starts here at the uh, turbine, friction turbine. Right above the friction turbine, we have the lower reaction vessel. It's filled with hot tar at 700 Fahrenheit, flowing from top to bottom. In the back of the lower reaction vessel, material is fed in at a metered rate on a continuous basis. It's cross-flowed with catalytic cracking fluid coming from the upper reaction vessel starts to depolymerize immediately when it gets into hot oil. Catalytically, we're breaking down the molecules in the uh, solid waste into diesel molecules, and some are larger, some are smaller. The turbine takes a suction, heats up the material, uh, shreds it, breaks it down, pumps it out through a, a uh, back pressure valve into the upper reaction up into the volatilization chamber where diesel molecules are vaporized and start their way up through the distillation column. The catalytic cracking fluid flows down into the upper reaction vessel. Uh, waste that is not reacted is reacted in the upper reaction vessel. Material is then flowed back to the back of the lower reaction vessel where it meets up with more solid waste. The process starts over. The volatilized diesel goes through the distillation column. Heavy molecules condense and go back into the process, into the volatilization chamber. The lighter molecules, the diesel molecules, CO, CO2, water, volatilize, collect in the condenser as liquid. The liquid drains down as rough product. We're blending water and diesel at that time. It goes into the rough product tank. The overhead gas, the non-condensables, carbon monoxide, carbon dioxide, methane, etc., get collected in the vent header. There's a blower that draws the uh, non-condensable gases and combustion air forward, discharges that into the diesel generator. It gets combusted along with uh, liquid diesel. The diesel generator is burning. Provides electricity to run the process and exhaust through a catalytic converter for zero emissions. I hope this technical review helped you to understand our process a little bit better. We would like to thank you for watching this video. We would also like to thank the big reception we received and we would like to thank the organizers of Waste Expo because they did an incredible job and without their help and consistency on calling us, we would not have been here and I think it would have been a big loss for us and for the industry because people are telling us that they are very happy that we are here, that they know now that we have a future and we can take care of the waste problem. Again, thank you very much and we're looking forward to helping you all around the world.